Hey guys, this week I've decided to show you everything. Well, virtually everything. We all are far too familiar with virtual events these days, but I've decided to highlight the ones that I have been a part of lately, mainly through showing you the swag. Here goes everything. Okay, first up was Shawshank. I ran this in person last year with my good friends Jackie and Juanita, and I was an inmate. But as we all know this year, twist turned everything upside down, and I'm a guard this year. But let's check out the swag. First up was the bib, which is the reason I knew I was a guard, right there. This was something that they added this year, special to the virtual event, and that was a Shawshank Hustle hat. It has the prison there in the background. It says Shawshank Hustle. Does anyone else feel like their head doesn't look good in hats? Like my head is a weird shape? I don't know, could just be my imagination. But look what the brim says. Every year I'm hustling. Do, 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 do. Yeah, dancing isn't my thing either. So we have the hat and also a shirt. Now this is tech material. It says Shawshank Hustle on the front and has all the sponsors on the back. And if you're wondering, I got a medium. Now, this bag, I'm gonna unroll it slowly. Pretty positive our bling is in there. Oh dear. It's a really nice drawstring bag that says Shawshank Hustle. It has one large compartment and a zipper compartment in the front. Let me just make sure, yes. <laughs> Safety pins, never have enough of these. That was sarcasm and I just dropped one anyway. I'll find it later. Or not, it's all right. This bling is really the reason that I did this run. Last year, Jackie, Juanita, and I dressed up as Andy's girls. And this year, once I saw the medal, I just knew I was a goner. I was, I was gonna register for this race because look, this medal, is of Raquel in her fuzzy britches, which is who I dressed up as last year. But it gets better, guys. This medal is hinged. Look, it has a countdown up here at the top, and here's the hole in the cell wall that Raquel covers. And look at this. You have the warden staring down the hole wondering what happened but Andy has already made his exit. The ribbon is a kind of pinstripe or cell bar pattern, and it says Shawshank Hustle, 2020 finisher. There's one more thing at the bottom here, and that's a little treat. It's a kind bar. I like to be kind, and it's dark chocolate, nuts, and sea salt. Next up is another run that I did last year with my friend, Denise, and this year I did it virtually with my ducks. I'll post the group picture when we have it, but for now, let me show you the swag. First up is this jacket. Instead of a tank or a t-shirt, we signed up as a group, so we got jackets. It says Wonder Woman Run Series right there. Red, white, and blue, of course. It's maybe a little tighter than I normally would wear. I got a women's medium in this. Like I said, we registered it as a team, so I'm not sure what might be different individually versus team. I'm sure they said it, but it's been a while, and I've been holding on to this bag eagerly until everyone got theirs. We have another hat. This one is really nice. It is more of a tech or performance material. On the back it says, hashtag, I am Wonder Woman. Yes, I am. Just not wonderful wearing hats, it seems. We'll get it into shape. Back to the bag, we've got, well, a bag. It is a tote bag with the Wonder Woman logo there and the Run Series logo there. Here is my bib. Oh, I signed up for the 10K. I thought I signed up for the 5K, but apparently not. What else we got in here? We have the Wonder Woman sweatbands, and they do have a zippered compartment. And this is the snack. It is Organic Banana Bites. I'll give it a shot. Now for the bling. The ribbon says, Hashtag, I am Wonder Woman. The medal itself says Wonder Woman Run with the Wonder Woman W. On the back, oh, I love this. It says, strength, grace, and love. 
Love it. I really thought I signed up for the 5K. I was ambitious back then, it seems. I'm feeling very mediocre right now. All right, next up is my PHRC medal from my Lightning Has Struck 5K. Across the bottom, as always, it says something, and this one says, hashtag amplify the signal. Let me get my scissors here. I have struck gold, you guys. The ribbon has radio broadcasting towers. The front, it's my very own travel size radio. Love this model. I'm pretty sure that this lights up. Let me see if I can figure it out in a minute. But on the back it says, keep each other safe, keep faith, good night. And I'm pretty sure if I hit this button, maybe. Oh no, I think my light may have fallen off. Oh, you know what? I think it has tape on it, you guys, that I have to remove. Remove this if you have this metal because I think that's what's keeping it from flashing. Yes, it's like magic. You are trouble. All right, next up, I told you I had a lot, are my Run Disney medals from the virtual series, which we just officially finished last week. So here we go. It's packed in there tight. Okay, I got it. So we have this jam-packed box of them. So I'm gonna try to do these in order. Plastic. First up was the 5K I ran with my parents, and that was themed after the teacup ride. The ribbon is in the teacup pattern, and in Wonderland Wonderful Riding, it says Run Disney Virtual 5K. I had it upside down just a minute ago. That would have been fitting. I should have kept it like that. Everything's a little bit different in Wonderland. The front has a teacup and it's kind of raised and it's kind of tilted, a little wonky. There are lanterns at the top, which are along the ceiling on the actual ride. And it says 2020 in a kind of glass feature. I will say, I wasn't very impressed with this medal when I just saw a picture of it but seeing it in person is much different. I love the colors, it's very vibrant. I do think it's fitting of Alice in Wonderland and that ride. Next up was my personal favorite ride and the run I did for my birthday week and that was themed after Space Mountain. Whoa, this is a big boy. Oh my gosh. You know, my friend Kristen over at Running and Makeup unbox these on her Instagram. So I'm quoting Kristen on a lot of this, but it has Space Mountain, the ride in the back with these little space travelers in front, has a starry background, Run Disney 5K. And this is something that Kristen mentioned, which I didn't see in the pictures or it didn't sink in. But on this side of the ribbon, it says Run Disney Virtual 5K. But look at this, where it says five years running. This is meant to be the track lights and I didn't realize that. And when I watched Kristen's video, I was floored. She just did a fantastic job. So I wanted to give her a little shout out. And I'm gonna put her channel right here. If you have not yet subscribed to her channel, please do so. She is amazing, a wonderful human being, and an amazing YouTuber, and a runner. I mean, the girl is good. Next up, and the last race of the series was the Haunted Mansion 5K. On the ribbon, oh, it's beautiful. Purple's my favorite color, you guys. Anyway, it's the wallpaper, and it says, Run Disney Virtual 5K 2020. Really creepy. Oh, this is just magnificent, you guys. Here is the front. This Madame Leota with this ornate copper frame. Coolest thing, which, Again, I didn't realize from the pictures, but then my friends started pointing it out. There's like a clear dome over her face so that it sits back in the frame and makes it look like her head is floating in there, like a true crystal ball. That is amazing. Last but not least is the challenge medal. I'm not gonna lie, I had to ask what this was. Here it is. Again, I had to ask what this was. This is what used to be the ride ticket books. You would take these tickets to the corresponding ride. And I've heard that the E were the really exceptional rides and you always ran out of E. On each letter, it actually has a five year symbol stamped on it. That is just really cool. I have yet to go to Disneyland and we share a birthday. So I really think that needs to be remedied soon. I thought there was 
one more piece. Aha! It was hiding. I wouldn't have found that piece if I hadn't been paying attention to my friend Kristen's video. So thank you, Kristen. In each of the virtual Run Disney shorts that I've done in the past, there's always an extra little goodie if you sign up for the challenge. This year, it is a mini replica of the challenge medal. Kristen once again mentioned this. You can make this a Christmas ornament by hanging it by the ribbon. I would probably keep these backs on there though, just in case. All right, so coming up, I'll have a hot chocolate run that I'm doing. As a Bib Brave Pro, wait until you see the swag for that one. Holy marshmallows. And I'll share more information about a new affiliate program I'm involved in. Check out my Instagram if you can't wait until then to know. Phew. Well, I think that's virtually everything. Please like, comment with your favorite piece of swag Subscribe and ring the bell two times for notifications. Bye guys. I need another Renoir.